I was walking by here on the way here tonight, and I saw a guy on a payphone, and I thought, you know, at least I'm not on a payphone right now. <laughs> you know, I'm not that guy. And then I thought, who's got it worse? The guy who's on the payphone, or the guy he's calling? It's <laughs> <laughs> you know, not like, hey, I just got a promotion. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm getting older, I'm rolling with the punches. You know what, guys? I'm learning that life truly is a box of chocolates, and we all have a peanut allergy. <laughs> uh, what else is going on, guys? Airplanes? Come on, I was in an airplane class the other day. It's horrible. <laughs> I'm not afraid of flying. I'm not afraid of the crash. I'm afraid of what happens after the crash. I'm uncomfortable with the idea that my seat is also a flotation device. <laughs> what if I'm floating in the middle of the Atlantic there, and some guy swims up to me and he's like, excuse me, that's my seat. <laughs> <laughs> There's a standard crash position. You guys know this? You've seen this? You're supposed to cross your arms and bend like this and put your hand... These are crash, pos crash positions like this. I don't know about you guys, but my crash position's like this. One more time. Ladies, I'm going on dates, I'm single. <laughs> uh, had to get some new means of transportation though, because my car is now old enough to drink. It's been smoking for years. <laughs> uh, so I got a bike. I got a bike. Chicks love getting picked up on the bike. I'm like, on the pigs. So hold on. I went to a store. This is a bicycle I'm talking about. I went to a store uh, to get some apparel. So I wanted to wear some. You know, I don't know if you guys see biking apparel, it's horrible, right? It's like the worst clothes ever, these guys, bikers. And I was like, what, what is, what's going on here? And the guy's like, it makes you go faster. I said, oh, because it's skin tight, it's, it's aerodynamic. He's like, no, it's embarrassing as fuck, you just pedal. <laughs> Get out a bunch of people, you're gone. <laughs> so, yeah, so ladies, I'm on Tinder. <laughs> Every girl on Tinder is the same way. Have you guys been on Tinder? Is anybody on there? No? Match me. What's up? <laughs> uh, get on Tinder and every girl says the exact same thing. They say to you, they say, I'm not here for hookups. This is a picture of me in my bikini licking my ankles. <laughs> not here for hookups. This is a picture of the inside of my vagina. <laughs> Get your mind out of the gutter. <laughs> yeah, I, uh, I'm actually, uh, I've been living with some gay guys, guys. This is true. I, I moved into the basement. I live with two gay men now. And I'm in the basement, so we call it Bottoms Up. <laughs> and, uh, the best part about living with some gay guys is we were watching some football the other night. And they're, they're not very flamboyant, they're very masculine dudes, and they know a lot about the game. So they're like, oh man, that was a great play. Did you see that play action? It's just like any other guy. But then every once in a while, they'll be like, oh my god, look at that beautiful pass. That guy could tear me in half. <laughs> and if he tore me in half, he would rip me in half and throw me across the field. And I'd be flying away like, I love you! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, thanks so much guys. Thank you very much.